In this video, I'm going to show you the inside of an ATS, an applicant tracking system, and also clear up a common lie that is told to job seekers. Now, on my screen here is Lever ATS. It's one of the top applicant tracking systems available to recruiters. On the left hand side is the jobs that I am assigned and responsible for. And as you can see, I'm looking at applicants. Now, this is a demo account, so there's no real information here. This is what a recruiter sees. As you can see, the top applicant right now is Will Truman. But if I go to the external page, which job seekers will see and want to apply for a job, I'm going to hit apply and then it's going to ask me to attach my CV. So I attach my CV. What's happening now is the applicant tracking system is scanning for contact information. It's not scanning for keywords to rank your resume. That is a lie. Now, once it's populated the information and then I hit submit application, what happens here is it goes basically goes to the top of the pile. Before it was Will Truman, now it's myself. And applicant tracking systems typically will uh, categorize or organize candidates by date. A lot of people think that an AI bot is scanning and auto-rejecting based on keywords. That does not happen. That is a lie. If anyone can show me via Loom of a system that auto-rejects based on keywords, I will buy them pizza. Now, you might have seen softwares like JobScan or Enhanced CV that rank your resume based on an ATS. That is completely separate software. That ranking system ability does not exist in an applicant tracking system. This is completely separate software. This software is designed to take job seekers money. This software is designed for recruiters to organize applicants and move them through pipelines. Ranking your resume based on keywords is not something that happens in an applicant tracking system. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments. Thank you.